All right, canvassers and canvas organizers, thank you so, so much. We're talking about events. We're talking about how to canvas events. It's one of the best ways to be able to get many signatures at the same time. So there's a few things. First of all, you want to identify an event where you're able to move freely. Uh, if you can have a booth, cool, but it really isn't necessary to have a booth for an event. Uh, it's fantastic, fantastic if it can happen, but what's most effective is actually people, a team out there with clipboards and talking to people. People do come to a booth, but you're gonna have much more of a uh, effective canvas when you're out there actually talking to people. So gather your team, talk a little bit about the event, talk about the same thing that you would do for any Canvas event. The difference with events is that you want more clipboards on you. You want to have four or five clipboards stacked up, obviously each with a pen, and be able to approach people in their little groups, because people are in their friend groups. So the you know, you approach, you connect with someone, are you interested in decriminalizing, decriminalizing marijuana? They say yes or no, and you go from there. Usually it's a yes. If they say yes, you just start passing the clipboards out to their friends, and it's amazing how fast you can continue to cycle those clipboards along. And so it's, yeah, one of the best ways to be able to gather many signatures at once. And usually people of like mind are going to events. So you're gonna get our people and uh, you're gonna get them all in one place. So it's recommended. Plus you get to go to a fun event. <laughs> Thank you so much for your help. If you do know of anyone that can help our campaign, we need bodies and we need them now. So thank you, and uh, please, if there is anybody that you know that wants to help out, wants to volunteer, they can get in touch with me or Nick at volunteer at sensiblebc.ca. Thank you so, so much. You're awesome.